Hey everyone, Kiwi King 77 here from the Android Creative Syndicate team here to do a video showing you the latest method to root and install Clockwork Mod on your Samsung Epic 4G, the original one with the keyboard. Finally got it back. But uh, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you the latest method if you um, are on stock. Um, go ahead and uh, I'll show you guys I'm on stock. I'm going to go to menu settings, about phone. Uh, build number for audio ec 5 firmware 2.2.1 so as you can see this method works for gingerbread or froyo so if you're on eh17 or ec 5 this works so just a heads up there so click on the link in the description of the video it takes you to the android creative syndicate forum let me scroll up as you can see android creative syndicate forum big thanks to chris 41g acs head chef friend of mine as you can see, ACS recovery, um, it's the latest Clockwork Mod recovery, it is Clockwork Mod 4 based. Uh, but what we're going to need to do is you're actually going to need to download and install Odin. Um, if you don't have Odin, I'll post a link in the description of the video. Uh, it's going to be a zip file and you're going to need to extract it to a folder. So just make sure you have uh, Odin. Um, if it look, the, zip, the download's going to look like this, sorry guys. Um, but do, you can double click on the zip, you're going to need WinRAR, WinZip, or 7-Zip, so you can double click on it. Um, you're only going to need, well, just go ahead and uh, extract all the files, just hit extract to and then make a folder to extract it to. So if I hit extract to, I'm going to want to extract it, let's say I want to extract it to my Tim folder. So I click on Tim, I hit OK, it extracts to there. And then I go to the Tim folder, double click on Odin, I can open it up. So just a heads up there, I'll post the download link to there um, as well. So just a heads up, go ahead and uh, what you're going to need to do is if you're coming from stack, download this. Tar, ACS Recovery 1.0.0.5.tar.md5. So click on it, open up the page, it'll start the download automatically. So just a heads up there, it's going to be called um, ACS Recovery 1005.md5. So just a heads up there. So looks, um, you're good to go. Then once you have all those, oh, you're actually going to need to install, download this SU zip right here. So click on that, download it, and put it on your SD card. You're gonna need that zip to flash through Clockwork Mod when you're done. So just make sure this zip is on your SD card as well. So once uh, you're all set there, you're good to go. If you are on a previous version of Clockwork Mod, you can just uh, update to this version really quick. Um, just download this zip here. I have a how-to video here. You can click on that as well. So just a heads up there, that's how to update. But anyways, once you have the zip on your SD card, once you have the tar file uh, downloaded, and once you have Odin downloaded, you're good to go. Go ahead and open up Odin and uh, hit yes. You can use an older version of Odin if you like. If it's, uh, I believe, the later, the later version is, let me take a look. 1.61 if you want to use that one that works just fine but anyways make sure you only have auto reboot checked um and over on the side here check the pda box select pda and then you're going to need to navigate to wherever that uh basically acs recovery 1005 tar was downloaded so right here so navigate to it as you see mine's in my downloads i'm going to double click on it it's going to be the tar file right here in odin and once again, only auto reboots checked. Once you're done there and you have the SU zip on your SD card, go ahead and power off your device. So go ahead and turn off your Samsung Epic. Once your phone is completely powered off, go ahead and you're going to need to go into Odin mode to do so or download mode. Go ahead and select, press and hold the one button on the keyboard and the power button at the same time. So press and hold both of those at the same time. Keep it held down until you get into download mode. As you can see, it says downloading right there. Once it shows this, uh, you're going to need to go ahead and um, plug in your phone into your computer. So plug it on in. It... Um, plugs it in and once you plug it in uh, you're gonna need to go back to Odin and it should show a yellow box right here once you plug in your phone and it should say com and then a number don't worry about the number it doesn't matter but that just shows that Odin recognizes your phone so once you're done with that you're actually good to go only auto reboots checked once you have the ACS recovery tar in the PDA box you're good to go hit start shouldn't take too long at all might take like nine seconds something like that if I had to guess it's just gonna flash the custom recovery on your phone as you can see it'll reboot your phone when it's done it says pass took eight seconds and it'll reboot my phone when it's done. Once it's rebooted, I'm gonna go ahead and power off the phone again. And then I'm gonna show you guys how, that means you're gonna, what this method did was actually just give you clockwork mod. You're not rooted yet, you only have clockwork mod. So once you uh, your phone reboots, go ahead and power it right back off. So power off your phone again. 
you can go ahead and unplug your phone too as well. Uh, but just go ahead and make sure your phone, my phone isn't completely powered off yet, but make sure it powers off completely. And once it is powered down completely, you're gonna need to boot into clockwork. When I say boot into clockwork, it means the custom recovery for the phone. This is gonna be the same method to boot into clockwork as always. To do so, you press the volume down, camera button, and power button at the same time. Press and hold all three of those at the same time. So press and hold them. Keep it held down. Just keep holding it down. I press and hold it until the bottom backlit keys light up. So once these keys light up, you should be good to go. I'm going to go ahead and let go. But now, as you can see, here's the latest version of Clockwork Mod ACS Recovery, version 1.0.0.5, Clockwork Mod 4 Base, to navigate through Clockwork. Volume up and down to navigate through it, and then camera button to select. So um, basically, you have all options to flash ROMs, kernels, themes. If you go to Install Zip from SD Card and select the uh, camera button, you have Pre-Theme Install Wipe and Pre-ROM Install Wipe, which is very nice features, and you use the bottom uh, soft key to go back. But now that you're in uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery, you can just go ahead and go to Install Zip from SD Card, select it, and then hit Choose Zip from SD Card. Select that as well, and now navigate to wherever that SU 3.0 sign.zip is. Once you've, uh, once you've highlighted that, select it with the camera button, and then just go down and hit Yes, Install SU 3.0. Select it. What this is going to do is install BusyBox uh, as well as Super User and give you root access. So hit the Back button again, and then just hit Reboot System Now. So it's going to go ahead and reboot your phone. When your phone is booted back up, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys that you are now rooted and you obviously have clockwork mod as well all right now that my phone has booted back up obviously i have clockwork mod i'm going to go ahead and show you i do have super user installed now there you go super user right there in my app drawer if i did go to a root uh with to an app that asked for root access it would ask for super user requests and i hit allow but uh, there you go, you're good to go. Now you do have root access and clockwork mod. That's the latest way to do it. Um, if you do have an older version of clockwork, an old custom recovery, you can flash it with Odin if you want, or you can just flash that zip file I've shown in that video. But anyways, if you do have any questions at all, feel free to ask, leave a comment. I'll be happy to help you out. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at QBKing77. All links will be down in the description of the video. Be sure to subscribe as well for future how-to videos. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up.